Hey folks, welcome back to Disco Elysium. Let's get started. Okay. Uh, we were playing a physical archetype, weren't we? Okay. There is only darkness. Your conscience ferments in it. You don't have to do anything anymore. <laughs> ever. Ever? Ever, ever, baby. Never, ever? Never, ever, ever, baby. <laughs> An amount of time passes. It is utterly void of struggle. And no X anythings are contained within. This is great. Yes, it is. Mm, give me some more of that sweet nothing. Nothing upon sweet nothing. I like nothing. I know. <laughs> oh, this is great. It is. But thou must! Trauma? Un Unawareness creeps up on you! A ball of meat surrounding you! Can I return to nothing? No, you can't! Wait. It is foolish of you to resurface! The damage is irreversible! Sail through the air! Pelagic Joan. Besides, you wouldn't like it if I told you what was back there. Poured so much over yourself. Got a bit carried away, did we, Chief? I did this? Yes, you're one disco mother. There's this giant ball there. It's basically all just evil apes. Like the end of Off? Don't get ahead of yourself. They're duking it out on a giant ball. Is the ball big? You can't even make out how big the ball is when you're duking it out. They're vying for resources. You have to beat the other evil apes in the face or you lose. That's sad. Yes, it is. You drowned in that. You lost. Oh, good. Psycap increased to two. You awake in a trashed room. You remember nothing. Okay, so how do we do this? Uh, it's a tape deck. Totally trashed. Someone has ripped out the tape. The roll reads, The smallest judge in Sun Sun! Sorry, uh, no, it reads, The smallest judge in Sun Sun. Take the tape? Yes. You re-roll it as best you can, but you'll need proper tools to repair the tape. Picked up audio tape. Okay. Uh, where's the window? Found one magnesium. Excellent. You have no memory of your own face. Look at your reflection. Yeah. Are you sure? You, you might not like what you say. Sigh eight. This is gonna hurt, isn't it? Behold! That's a pretty good pixel portrait here. The look on your face is frozen, holding a single expression. The expression. It's awful. Oh gosh. Uh. Failure! Psi increase to, to one? What? You really do look awful. We need to get. That's fizzant, isn't it? We need to get you to the gym! Minus one morale. How do I check these things? I don't even know. 
There we go. Status. Skills. Intellect. Raw brain power. How smart you are. Capacity to reason. Intellect is zero out of one. Ouch. Psy. Psyche. Sensitivity or emotional intelligence. Power to influence yourself and others. Your psyche is one out of two. Physique. Your strength. Musculature. How well your body is built. Your physique is one out of two. Motorics. Your senses and agility. How well you move your body freely. Your motorics is one out of one. Okay. Hey, no, take me back. Status. Officer profile. This is you. Your expression is awful. I know. Morale is your mental status. Your morale is one out of two. Health is your bodily status. Your health is three out of three. How much cash you have in the real? Nothing. Oh, that's how you navigate this. Okay. Idea locked. Seems cool as hell. Like something Kim would unlock. Okay. Idea locked. Your shit is all over the place. Unlock by keeping it together. No, you unlock that by getting it apart and then forcing it together. Idea locked. Something inside you yearns. Unlock by letting out your soul. Idea locked. The key to unlocking it must be around here somewhere. Beds. Magnesium. Used to recover one morale. Back. Key items. A damaged audio tape. Of the smallest church in San Fab. You'll need tools to repair it for proper place. Alright. Uh. I don't. There's gotta be a better button that does that. Hey, get... Okay, fine. Uh, but where's the fan? Okay, fine. Uh-oh. Found one painkiller. Cool. Is that my shoe? All around you, rain falls on Revachol. It drips from the eaves and gutters, washing the filth away. The spring must be here. The snow is melting. You can see a distant city twinkling across the bay. It's locked. I'm gonna regret this. Hello, officer. What do? Officer? Am I military? Uh... No. Chief Executive Officer? You're a police officer, sir. Unless you've been feeding us elaborate lies all this time. All this time? You've been here for three days, officer. She has smokes. <laughs> you need smokes! I can use a cigarette. Could you share a smoke? Sure. Found one cigarette. Where am I? You're in a hostel. A hostel where? In Revachol, sir. Martinez, to be exact. Be careful, sir. They don't like officers here. But what about her? At least it didn't give us the choice to say something awful. It's locked. Found one. Hurry up. Okay. Let's go. <gasps> Kim! Hello. I am Kim Kitsuragi. Lieutenant Precinct 57. You must be from the 41st. My name is... Hi! My name is... Failure! Int increase to one. What? My name is Tequila Sunset. Interesting. Now that we are both here, we should begin our investigation. Let's start with the scene. It's behind the hotel. He seems unfazed. Kim Kitsuragi has joined your party. If you get lost, press select to speak with Kim about next steps. What's select? Uh... 
I'm gonna pause for a second and try to find the actual controls. BRB. Okay, so that... Hello? That should be... Not that. System. Ooh! Uh... No? Data not save. Okay. Exit. We should head to the scene. Find the whirling. It's been there for a week. It's a stage and a mic stand. Seems like a karaoke setup. You were meant for this! Don't even... Don't even think about it. But I have the need... Well, I don't. And it's for customers only. You still haven't paid. That's true. It's the same thing? Yes, it is. Oh my gosh, this is great. I mean, no, this is totally just a regular video in the series. Uh, we're gonna ignore Gart for now. What's in the hospital? Or in the kitchen? Nobody? Found one mag. An unremarkable steel door. It's a single keyhole. There must be something inside. The door is solid but old. Enough force may break the hinges. Easy prey. <laughs> Reinforced hinges. That's why it's still here. Walk away. That's a fizz 10. We're not going to do that. But that also tells me, on 5 real, that there are things to find that the game doesn't tell you because there's no little pip. I, I know, I know. Stop, stop. Let me out, let me out. And again... What am I here for if not to try ridiculous checks? And I'm kind of learning the mechanics of how and why things get increased. Wait, was that my mouth cursor on the whole video? Whatever, I can't think about that. Holy poo! Success! His cap increased to three. You shoulder slam the door. Ow. The door falls back in a cloud of dust. Mysteries beyond the door open to you. Uh. Let's wait a minute here. No, let's just go straight back. We're going to break the plot. Old pinball machines covered in a layer of dust. The pinball boom was decades ago. No one has been here in the ages. Wrong. Fresh footprints. A week old. No more. Want to play, Kim? Detective, you know that I have no interest in reliving my pinball days. But I don't know that. Ooh. Elevator was automatic. Found for real. An old bench and some small tool. Attempt to repair the audio tape? Yeah! Success! Motorix cap increased to two. You use the tool. Carefully rewind the tape. Oh, God! Hey. I know the answer to these things. Found two real. No? No diary? Found two speed. Kim, look the other way. Found five real. All right, we're kind of breaking the plot here. How can I help you, officer? Nothing at the moment. All right, we're not breaking the plot here, but, uh, there's, there's no, nothing for the footprints? Okay. Fine, no sequence breaking. That room is reserved for the dock workers' union. All right. What's up, gardener? Hello. Please move the body soon. I'd like to get to my garden. Something seems off about her. We know that.
All right, what's up, Gart? Hello, officer. Your bill is 20 real. Please return when you can. Well, uh, what do I have? I have 20. If I pay him, I'm a customer and I can do karaoke. Found six real. I guess we can't uh, tell the racist some things to do. <whistles> Whose wheels are these? Idea. Dumb rock shuffle. Up. Look, Kim, I'm only kind of sorry. Uh, do I want to go pay? What's with all the traffic? The dock ahead is on strike. And someone has damaged the bridge out of town. They've got nowhere to go. All right. Okay. That was just happenstance. For a second, I thought you were following me, and I was kind of weirded. Found to your holodon. Wait. Not there. Something is hanging from it. Seems it was placed there through a window in the building. Okay. Let me... Alright, how about getting into Night City over here? So glad there's not a Pixel Kuno to deal with. Kuno was ready! 8-bit style! Kuno doesn't give a shit how many polygons you have! The body rots, and the smell is overpowering. And I thought you look rough! Hold your guts! I don't even know which is going to be better. Okay. Probably not better. Success? Fizz cap increased to four. Your body is under your control, and no smell will change that. Idea. Volumetric shit compressor unlocked. Beginning visual assessment. Where should we start? Uh, let's take a look at the footprints. Success! Hint cap increased to two. You are able to discern eight unique sets of prints. Damn, I'm pretty good at this. Yes, you are. Eight sets of heavy work boots. The rope is a cargo belt. Maybe our culprits work at the dock. Need a clearer look at the body. Not sure how we can get it down. Do you have any ideas? Then shoot it down. We could. Shoot it? Not yet. Let's put that on hold. Um, I guess we just have to try. There's not a whole lot else to do. Game is very narrow in scope. It looks at the moment. It looks like. All right, I'll take the shot, as you don't seem to have your gun. I didn't even tell you that. Damn. Let me try. Oh boy, that's a ten. And I don't have enough, uh... Ah! Success? Moat cap increased to three. Him holds his hands in the air. Clap it. Idea. Aces high. Unlocked. Okay, now we can do the autopsy. I'll perform the inspection. You can fill out the form. Him hand you a form to fill out because you don't have your clipboard with many empty boxes. Coroner's case number KK57 0803 Date of death We'll go with March 3rd, 51. External examination Plus just armored boots and briefs. A large tattoo covers his chest and shoulder. Cargo belt around his neck. Well fed, athletic build, 1.8 meters tall. Several scars consistent with combat injuries. Hands are clean, no sign of struggle. Internal. Fluid coming from the mouth. Thyroid, thyroid bone. 
fractured blood present in mucus. Anne's mouth releases a stench. You feel sick again. Blood gathering at the extremities, consistent with hanging. Description of injuries. Bruises on head and chest. Ligature marks around neck. Sign of clawing. Drawn to the man's head. There is something there. You sure you want to look? Yeah. Failure! Int increased to two. Nothing. Just dark flesh. The stench returns. The ground falls out beneath you. You collapse onto the corpse. You heave a pale liquid across the man's face. Ugh. Minus one health. <sighs> At least we are finished here. We can't learn more here. We'll have to wait for the coroner to report. Meanwhile, we should find our dock work. Let's start by asking around the hostel. A group like this would be known about. Really? I mean, I guess it's a red check. Uh, I guess. Whatever. Now I'm cranky. Aha! That's open now. Oh boy. You can see something shining through the window. Open it. You open the window. A key is hanging from the bush. You got an old blue key. Alright, but uh, I already opened that. Alright, you're bigger than the rest, therefore you have to be the leader. This is the union's booth. If you need to speak with them, I'll be watching you. Why? I am the union's legal counsel. I thought you are the gardener. I'm both. Thanks, Elizabeth. All right! This is where you say your bit! Yeah, get to it, cops. We hardy boys want nothing to do with you. Yeah, you have no authority here. It appears we found our dock workers, though they, they are one man short. What the fuck you whispering about, Coppernado? Well, we'd like to ask you some questions. Yeah, I'm sure you would. I see seven men here. Is there an eighth, Hardy Boy? There ain't no eighth, Hardy Boy. Just the seven of us. We're all here, just like when we hung that bastard. We did this together. Sorry, we ain't hiring. Aha, so you just confessed to the murder? Too easy. That's right, we all did. Think you can just arrest all of us? We've told you what happened. Now get out of our town. Why? Why did you kill him? Because he was mercenary scum, and he stepped out of line in my town. It was harassing... It was harassing women and workers. Yeah. Yeah, he threatened to kill us if we didn't end the strike. And that was before he came here. Thanks, Angus. He had a live grenade, not bar. He was here drinking and just grabbing girls mid-karaoke. He assaulted someone. Grabbed her legs and started screaming at her while she sang. Who was she? You're not getting a name. That's a local matter. None of the RCM's business. Fuck off, cop. She's been through enough. If someone has been assaulted, we need to. You don't need to do anything. I'm trying to keep my boys in check, officer, but... How'd you kill him? We hanged him up until he went real stiff. Didn't you go to cop school? Any other details? We overpowered him here, then hung him out back. Yeah, we left him for the birds. And you. How'd you overpower him? With numbers, asshole. I've done enough explaining here. You just killed him like that? No remorse? How many people have you sent to the chair? Or to prison, to rot. For 20 years? For life? Ain't worth remembering? 
That's what I expected. They're right, detective. We can't arrest them all alone. We have no backup here. What should we do? I don't know, because my last time I tried something, it failed. Um... Failure! It's increased to two, but, uh... Well, I guess that's in then. Case closed. Kim, let's cuff these murderers. Huh? You moron! I'd like to see you try! Minus one health. Oh. Now get the fuck out of our town! Get the fuck out of here! Okay. Man. Your questioning is finished. Please leave my clients alone. Uh, don't know what else to do. Here, here's my bill. Heart. Thank you, officer. Anything else I can help with? Uh, I don't think I have any more left. Buy one alcohol for two real. I can? I didn't think you looked like a bartender. Here's the tape. Fine, fine, climb on that stage, and let's get this over with. Sing. All right. My time to shine. I would often stay there. In that tiny yard there. I have been so glad here. Looking forward to the past here. But now, you are all alone. None of this matters. None of this matters at all. At all. Idea. Extremely disco unlocked. All right. We did a thing. Health is your bodily status. Uh, we're gonna die. Case is high. A revolutionary Ravana Shoal custom. Oddly, Kim seems to be a fan. Provides plus one molt. Shit compressor. Your shit has reached previously unheard levels of togetherness. Provides plus one int. Cool. So... Uh, I mean, I'll, I'll take it. What are you? Extremely disco. Damn, you are one disco mother. Provides plus one sigh. Gamrock Shuffle. A precinct 41 classic. You leave nothing unturned. Provides plus one fizz. Ah, uh, I wish I had realized those. Hello, officer. Sure. So now you're a bartender. That's upsetting. No, let me out. Let me out of the menu. You don't have enough money. Tell me about it. Okay. So now what? No Gorasi? I talk to you yet? Did you talk to Titus? Unfortunately. Well then. Here's the end credits. Oh, I was right. Thank you for playing. I mean, that could have gone a lot better. Glacia, can you reset my checks so I can do them again? Huh. How can I help you, officer? Well, we've got a handful of the, the main storyline things going on. But, uh, here's it is heavily check-locked. 
And as much as I want to see what happens. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh. Yeah. All right. Well, this has been a fun episode of, of Totally Normal Disco Elysium. I will see you guys in the next episode, never. Or maybe if they expand on this. Alright, take care, folks.